All right, welcome back to SRD Plays Diamond Dynasty. This is pitcher event number two, where you get to pick your own pitchers, but everybody else on the team has to have a vision at less than 50, I believe is the rules. We're playing the North Carolina Tar Heels in this game. Uh, first up, we got uh, Wilson Contreras coming up, and uh, they struck him out, but uh, they lost the pitch on a wild pitch, and he made it to first base, so... So we get uh, our number two hitter on, and then here's uh, Domingo Santana comes up, and uh, he gets a pitch to hit and goes oppo. We're in Fenway, so straight down that right field line over Pesky's pole, and we take an early two to nothing lead. So yeah. So uh, he brings in Miguel Sano to pinch hit right away for Jake Lamb, and he immediately takes one down the line, and uh, he gets on to lead off the game. And his number two hitter is Mr. Aaron Judge. And he promptly doubles down the line. So we got runners on second and third. Right off the bat here, this was been a was a rough, uh, rough uh, start for me. James Paxton, it, I always have an issue with him. I, I, I don't, for some reason, I can't pitch well with him. So I go to the bullpen, start getting somebody warmed up right away, and uh, Giancarlo Stanton comes in and immediately goes deep. So uh, yeah, rough first inning. Rough first inning, so. And then uh, here comes George Springer. He's just continuing to make my life uh, a living you-know-what. He comes up, and he immediately uh, places one into the gap off the wall. So, uh, yeah. So he gets in for a double. So uh, I go to the uh, bullpen, bring a knee shack, and immediately uh, have a wild pitch. So I don't know, man. Uh, then this guy Taylor's up here, and uh, no matter what I did with this guy, uh, he was able to hit me. So, and uh, apparently he's not a. F Some people have a problem with knee shacks, uh, wind up, but apparently this guy did not. So, so later on. Uh, Already down four to two, and Judge comes in and doubles again. Curse those Yankees! And uh, so Nishak is just getting tore up, just tore up all over the place. So, so I bring in uh, Davinsky at this point, and uh, what do I do? What's the first thing I do? Here's Jean Carl, uh, Giancarlo Stanton, and uh, I did not do this on purpose, but I. Plunked one off his back. I, I kind of giggled when it happened, but I I didn't do it on purpose. So, And uh, I think uh, he was able to pretty much shut down the inning after that. So, But it was a uh, rough first inning for both of us. But he came out on top. Uh, so he's up, uh, what, 4-2 to two in the first inning. So here I am back pitching again. And uh, Gary Sanchez comes up. Daggone Yankees. Doubles off the wall. I thought it was going to be gone for a minute, but fortunately, uh, not the case. So, yeah, it was a kind of a rough inning, a rough game for me. Uh, George Springer. He comes in and he promptly takes one off the wall as well, and that uh, scores uh, another run for them. So we get this guy to uh, what we want him to do, Grant out, but uh, oh, I forgot they uh, yeah they stole third, which I hate it when they steal third in this game, man. It's so easy, it's ridiculous. The guy didn't have any speed to be stealing third like that, but uh, Gamble comes in and uh, we're trying to get out of the inning, get a strikeout, and he, well he grounds out, but unfortunately that's going to allow the uh, run to score. So. Uh, yeah, but then, then after that, the, we didn't do anything the rest of the game. Pretty much, we got really nothing, no highlights, nothing to really show you guys. We got mowed down pretty much. But uh, 
Davinsky was able to finally settle down and uh, have a fairly easy inning. Here he gets a ground out. And, uh, yeah, so. All right. And. This is our, it's the fourth inning, and we still, we have really nothing going on much at all, really. Uh, I'm not even sure why I'm even showing any of this here. I have to go back and look at it. Into the wind up. Here comes the but uh, yeah, and a change up see, for the first I'm just going down one, two, three every time I turn around. So Domingo Domingo. As he'll look to I could not touch this guy whatsoever. Uh, David Price, which is dominated me the whole game. I, the guy was really good. Uh, really moved the stuff around. Never repeated a pattern that I could see, at least you know. But. Uh, you know, I did what I could with what I got, and uh, I, I couldn't hit the guy. I really couldn't. It was uh, definitely a little rough outing for me. It's looking bad right there. Yeah. Looking really bad. Looking really bad, so. Ready for another. So Davinsky came in, and uh, for the next inning, this is the first three up, three down inning that he had, I believe. So we got two guys, to, one to strike out, him to fly out. And what else did I have? Oh, Stanton. Stanton came in and uh, flied out too, so I'm, I messed up on the edit on that. But uh, there and there is Chris Davis. Uh, Pretty much it, and this was the, I think this is the sixth inning here, yeah, this is my last three at bat, so, Jackie Bradley Jr. hit it well, hit it well, but right at the uh, right fielder, and then uh, is Wilson Contreras, he's my last gasp here, and he put, he got me to pop it up so yeah so uh yeah we we got destroyed pretty much i really couldn't hit this guy and you know sometimes that's the way it is but uh i don't know if you guys feel the same way about james paxton i cannot use the guy he's on my diamond diamond uh, diamond dynasty team but i can't use him so but anyway if you like the episode leave a like if you've not yet subscribed please do and we'll catch you next time on srd plays diamond dynasty thank you